Hello my friend, welcome back. Today is Monday. Um, over the weekend we went camping and we had such a good time. Um, it's honestly what we needed as a family. Um, I got to rebond with the kids. My husband and I spent some really good quality time um, around the fire both nights and we just had a really good time as a family. It was really nice to just get out in a way and just get out of the stress and anxiety bubble that I've been in um, the past couple videos. I've talked about one job not working out and then trying a different job and it turns out that it wouldn't work out for us as a family and you never know unless you try. So I've just been kind of really bummed out about all of that lately. But like I said, you never know unless you try and I'm grateful to be able to try things and see what works for the family and essentially now I know what works for us as a family so um getting out of the house and getting out of the stress and just getting away from everything was really what we needed as a family it's what I needed so I'm feeling refreshed today um, and I am just happy to be here so um, feeling so much better today um, than what I have in the past month and a half. It's just been a really big whirlwind, you know? So um, today we have a lot to do. Usually post camping um, on Sunday, we'll just park the camper, level it, and then the next day I will go out into the camper, one of my husband's at work and I'll clean it out and reset it for the next time we go camping. That way all we have to do is just pack up and leave. But it's raining today. Um, we have the rain from Hurricane Helen. Um, I don't live anywhere near Florida, but we get like the rain effects from it like a couple days later. So that's what is happening today. It's gonna be raining all day long and dreary and I really don't want to go out there and try to be cleaning out the camper and track, be tracking more mud and water in and out of it while I'm trying to clean it. So. Um, I think I'm just going to do all that tomorrow whenever it stops raining. So because it's raining and I'm going to be out in the rain in and out all day today, I didn't bother to do my hair. I just put some dry shampoo in it and threw it in a little ponytail because I'm just not going to spend the time doing my hair for it to just get ruined in the rain. Um, but with that said, I do have to go out and about today. I have to go grocery shopping. Uh, we have no food in the house, like no cold food. We have some snacks here and there, but we need fruit and like lunch and dinner things. And I just have to get like my meal plan and everything in order for the week. What time is it? My watch, I forgot my watch. I need to go put that on, but it is now 10.06. I'm going to, I also wanted to film a cleaning video today too. That's what also what I forgot. But anyway, I need to clean up the dining room table because we're gonna be doing schoolwork. I'm a free man, free to do just what I like, but I just don't seem to like what's new to me. Now I'm no one's man, and these streets that I've been walking, they make me feel like nothing. I tell my friends it's here where we begin. I say I'm better than I've ever been. It's like an enemy's that's caving in. I've never been. Now you're free, man. You better chase those dreams, and I don't think you're the perfect fit for me. I do believe that you're better off without me, cause you don't see what I see. Go tell your friends.
we are done with school now. Um, both kids did great. I just got my daughter um, out of the bath. She's cleaned up now. My older daughter is showering currently. Um, but while my kids did school, um, I went ahead and made my Aldi grocery list. Um, we need a ton more stuff than this, but this is just the stuff that we need for like dinners and some like specific things that I want to get at Aldi. Um, but I'll probably get some stuff that's not on the list as well, just because we need to restock everything. Um, I don't really know how we ran out of food all at once, but it happened and I need to restock. So, um, I'm going to clean up my kitchen because you guys know that I don't like to come back from grocery shopping with a messy kitchen because I just, I want all the room I can get whenever I come back so that way it's not chaos putting groceries away. So I'm going to clean up school stuff and then clean up my kitchen. Gracious, my husband put an air freshener in my car and I just smacked it. But we are now loaded up in the car. Uh, both kids got ready to go. I'm going to stop at the post office first to send out some mail. And then I'm going to go to Aldi. Um, typically, whenever I go grocery shopping, I like to do like a pickup order. Um, but because we need everything, I'd rather just go in and browse to see what they have because sometimes Aldi has like all different things. Um, you never really know what you're going to get from Aldi. So um, we're just going to go and browse and see what they got. It is 1238. We're making a really good time today. So let's get going. My husband drove my car last and now all the mirrors are all messed up because I am short. I am a petite person. That's better. Okay, let's go. Hopefully y'all don't fall off the dash. It's a real country variety. Here, Froggy. Ooh, don't fall. Hey, Frog. Happy to be here for an early Monday.
home now and it is raining and gross and I am damp. <laughs> but anyway, um, my feet are wet, my legs are wet, but I just brought everything in from the car um, and I'm going to go ahead and show you guys what I got from Aldi. I'll give you guys an overview of like what I got, but the grocery haul will be in a different video. Um, so definitely stay tuned for that video. I'm not sure if it was before or after this one, but um, yeah, I'm gonna film a grocery haul and then we'll put it all away. It is now almost 3.30. Um, I'm tired, so I'm making myself a cup of coffee. I'm just getting a K-cup down. Um, but, is there enough water here? I desperately need a cup of coffee, because I am tired. I didn't really sleep all that long last night, and I'm feeling it currently. Um, my husband should be getting off in about an hour or so depending on what they got going on. I really never know when he's getting off of work. But one of the things that I wanted to do today was wash all of the kids' new clothes and clean out my daughter's dresser. Let's see. I went grocery shopping, sent out the mail. Show haul of clothes, clean out her dresser. We did school so I could check that off. I'm getting a little sidetracked here. If I don't have a list of things that I have to do every day, I get lost. Okay, so something that I want to do is show you what I recently got for my kids. Um, we recently went to Target and my girls both got new shoes. My older daughter got a pair of like lace up, they look like New Balances almost, um, shoes and then she also got a pair of slip on Skechers shoes. 
Um, and then my younger daughter got a pair of light up shoes. <clears throat> so, um, are you gonna bring them over here? Thank you, baby. Look how cute they are. I love them. They're so cute. Thank you for letting me show them. And this is what her shoes look like. They light up. They're so cute. They both got really cute shoes. Um, they needed a new pair of tennis shoes desperately. So we went to Target. Uh, they both got their shoes from Target. Um, so we got my older daughter two pairs of shoes because my younger daughter just got a new pair of shoes uh, not too long ago um, that are like her play shoes. So my older daughter needed a couple pair. My younger daughter only needed one because she just got a new pair just a little while ago. But then we went to the mall um, and got some clothes for the girls for fall and winter. Now, I used to love shopping at Once Upon a Child. It was my favorite store, my coffee's brewing, um, to shop for the kids because I could get like a whole new wardrobe for the kids for, like per season for like $50 um, each, but they're growing out of that store. And my Once Upon a Child, I don't know if it's like a chain store, but it just doesn't have a whole lot for my daughter's size and my younger daughter's size you just never know what you're gonna get whenever you get there and i would rather just go to a store where i know has clothes that they like to wear even though it's a little more expensive i'm willing to pay it now because they're not as hard on their clothes as they were i'm gonna head go ahead and put some creamer in my coffee while i chat with you this is our creamer i put it in here for camping i'm just gonna finish this off but I wanted to show you what I got from the children's place um, I like their clothes there because they're very basic both of my kids like to wear leggings and t-shirts um, and jeans like once in a while but their style is like very basic very casual and I'm fine with what they wear because as long as they're comfortable and they look clean, I'm fine with it. So, um, a couple things in this bag are missing um, because they wore a couple things out of here so far. My daughter got, this is my older daughter's, she got a matching little like sweatsuit. She has joggers that have these stars down the leg. Um, they're black. This is like a little zip up jacket. I thought this was really cute. Um, but she needs a new jacket. My older daughter picked out this long sleeved butterfly shirt. Thanks, my. Oh no, this is my younger daughter's. Oh my goodness. My younger daughter picked out this butterfly long sleeve shirt. Um, my older daughter picked out this really cute little like Henley thermally shirt. She's so excited to wear it. She's been dying to wear it, but it's just been too hot so far. Um, my younger daughter just got some basic black leggings in 5T. Uh, actually, we went to Walmart recently, and um, my older daughter picked out some leggings because they didn't have any leggings from my older daughter at uh, the children's place. She has her black ones on now, so I got her a pair of black ones, and then she picked out these really pretty, um, like, teal and blue stars, and then the leopard print ones. Um, she wasn't small enough. She's in size medium growing like a weed my older daughter picked out to these um cute little tie-dye joggers i wish i had them in my size they're just so cute so she got two pairs of sweatpants and then she also got which ones are these these are i got my younger daughter a pair of jeans in 5t little like flare i think it's a boot cut i'm not sure but Super cute pair of jeans. And then my older daughter. Did you get two pairs of jeans or just one? I got two pairs. Two pairs? Uh, my older daughter tried to wear her jeans today. Um, this is what they look like. They're just like a mid wash kind of like flare jean. I got them in a size six. I'm not sure if we're going to keep these. Um, she wants to wash and dry the pair that she has and if she likes them after they're washed and dried because they're a little bit big on her right now, like around the waist. So I figured once they're washed and dried, they'll fit perfectly. But if not, I'm going to return these um, because 
they were $15. So I want to see if she likes them after they're washed and dried, I'll keep those. If not, I'll just return the ones and keep the other ones for like my younger daughter or whatever. Or I'll pass them down for hand-me-down. Um, a few shirts that my daughter picked out, picked out this turtle one. This blue butterfly it was really cute. Um, they had all of their Christmas stuff out, so she picked out her Christmas shirt. Um, I usually get the girls a Christmas like little outfit to wear um, either on Christmas Eve or Christmas, uh, whatever they want to wear it for. Something super casual because we don't really dress up for Christmas at all. Um, so she picked out her little festive shirt that she wants to wear this year. She got this darker blue butterfly one um, with the light blue butterflies, so that was really pretty. And then... She got a couple more shirts. She picked out this one. Black with the flowers. So those are all my older daughters and then these are my younger daughter's shirts. My older daughter definitely needed more than my younger daughter because my younger daughter has a lot of my older daughters like hand-me-downs. Um, so that's why we got her a few more shirts than my younger daughter because my younger daughter is pretty stocked on shirts because of hand-me-downs. But I wanted to get her some new stuff. Um, so that way she looked clean. Um, she picked out this little tiger for a cat. It's a tiger. Um, then she also picked out this one. This is totally her personality. I thought it was so cute while I went shopping with my older daughter. What, honey? Um, this is a cheetah. Oh, it's a cheetah? Well, that shirt was a cheetah. Whenever I went shopping with my older daughter, my husband took my younger daughter to her section and, um... He said that she picked out all of her shirts. Oh, we got two of the same shirt. I'm sorry. My younger daughter picked out a t-shirt even though we were there for long sleeve shirts. She picked this one out and she had to have it. So I let her get her tie dye shirt. Um, another one that she picked out was this one. This that little one. chick with hot cocoa. I thought that was really cute. Dad. And then I must have, whenever I went through, I must have grabbed this shirt because I wanted to get her a couple more shirts and I must have grabbed one. I didn't realize that she already picked this one out. So I'll probably go and just exchange this one um, or maybe we'll just keep it. You can never go wrong with another shirt. Um, so that was everything I got. They were having a 50% off sale. So I only spent a couple hundred dollars on all of their clothes for the fall and the winter and then probably some of this will fit next year as well um especially the long sleeve shirts for my older daughter i got them a little bit bigger that way they were longer she wore leggings um kind of like covered more you know what i mean so that is everything that i got from the children's place in their shoes and stuff like that i do plan on getting my older daughter some more leggings for the winter because she definitely needs some bigger leggings um she's has grown out of all of her size small and now she's in size medium and I just like their clothes to be a little bit more respectful so and modest i swear finding clothes nowadays for little kids that don't show their midsection or or that are not super skimpy is very hard so that's why i like the children's place because all the clothes um for the most part are pretty modest so that is what i got for them and i also need to go through my younger daughter's dresser but honestly i really don't feel like doing that right now i'd rather just sit down and drink my coffee and kind of like recollect myself oh also i got her leggings hold on a minute i knew i was missing something my younger daughter picked out these leggings um i wanted to get my older daughter leggings like this but they didn't have any in the store so i'm just gonna have to buy her some um but she got all, she's wearing a pair of her black ones that she got and she got a bunch of 5T like purple pink tie dye and then ones with like little things on it and then um, tie dye pink and then ones with little things on them as well. She picked these out. Um, I need to wash them but I am going to get my older daughter some of these from the children's place. I just need to order them for her. Aren't you tired of the drama? You use your words like they are knives. Mm -hmm. I don't need the 
your type of drama and trying to be tough all the day time you try to make yourself feel better by taking me down once i fell but now i'm strong i'm ready for the rematch It is now 6.09. Uh, we are about to head out and about for a little bit. So I'm just gonna end the video here. Um, I planned on cooking dinner and whatnot, but the kids and I ate a really late lunch and they're not hungry. That pretty much does it for this video. My husband and I are just gonna be hanging out for the evening. Thank you so much for being here. I'll see you in my next one. Mm -hmm.